Hello, today we're building a water bottle stand that's in the shape of a water bottle. Yes, I was practicing this and it actually turned out okay. It turned out all right. So yeah, let's let's build this, shall we? So I was planning this video idea ever since the <laughs> ever since I made the update video. I'm like, I'm gonna sell these wa new water bottles and stuff by making a water bottle stand. And I didn't want to make like a, a typical stand. I wanted to make fun. And we're gonna be selling these um, water bottles we get from the new dispenser here. This uh, beverage dispenser that we got from the update and the metal ones that you can only get at the gym. So we're gonna be stealing the, the metal ones from the gym and you know selling both types because people need to stay hydrated i've made a whole hydro flask house before now this this is not very surprising so here's how i built it i went to the basic shapes i found myself a nice vertical cylinder i made that super flat because i want this to be like portable and then you just kind of just expand it all the way just kind of make it as wide as you can you're gonna make sure one of these sides are facing like the the grid yeah just like that it works a little bit better with the grid and in total it's like pretty much it's a three by three but you still got those diagonals but anyway Ways. I'm gonna go into the basic shapes again and I'm going to just scale a cube okay and it would really be helpful depending on your character's height I'd definitely suggest you um, scale it based off of that so that way you're able to get into your stand comfortably um, in case you're too tall or like sometimes you can be too tall and it'll be a nightmare so just kind of like measure your character and um, build your basic shape wall and then we're just going to wrap this entire basic shape all around this bottom platform once again i i like having this bottom piece because you can then move the entire thing if you'd like definitely do not recommend building this on grass purely on grass because then you'll have to move every single piece individually i was just practicing earlier and when i like kind of finished it i was i was kind of hysterical i was laughing it was very funny it don't take too long it depends how fast you are and then of course this is where you're oh you know i made a little whoopsies here there's a there's a few rough parts it's not perfect it's okay if your um, water bottle stand is not perfect um it adds character okay but this is generally like eh, that's how it is <laughs> just kind of how it is let me just move this one in a bit okay see you can move it around you do want to make the of course um the area to get in now all i have to do is just copy this again and then kind of scale it down so it's like window it's like a mini window here okay i need to like fix some stuff hold on good thing we have the transform tool oh my gosh it's okay you don't even need the transform tool to be doing this i mean as long as you have advanced placement you should be great okay there's our little window that's pretty much it in terms of building this piece uh, so this right here this is just another vertical cylinder that i scaled up made it as wide as possible and then scaled up the height i think it's possible just to like put it inside this and then transform it i'm just gonna grab another vertical cylinder i don't even think i need to be doing this but i'm just gonna do it because why not you know it doesn't cost that much it's okay you grab another one of these put it inside that and then scale this one up and you'll be able to layer this piece on top of this which will be nice and make sure it fits snug you know make sure this piece fits okay there will be a bit of um you know just a few problems here and there just gotta fix it okay okay now we gotta lower that a little bit we don't have any like cracks through we don't see any cracks through there okay that's good enough and then we put this on top and just make sure this is also you know matching up we don't want it kind of goofy all right, and that's how you do that. The base of this water bottle is really, really simple to make. It's too, it's very easy. This is the fun part. This is the fun part. Easy part of the water bottle done. Like, it's super easy. Now we have to build, like, kind of this top piece right here, which is, of course, the, um, the, the spout. This is where you drink out of the water bottle. Okay, so this little hourglass piece, it's kind of an hourglass shape in a way. That was a bit challenging to, like, think of in my head with the basic shapes, but all I did was just... Um, I just built this thing, you know, I, I used another beveled vertical cylinder here and made it slightly smaller than, I'm just gonna center it, made it slightly smaller than the actual water bottle. And then I put like another one on top of that, that's slightly, as you can see, it's kind of like a burger style. And then I just dyed it black and this will be like the actual, this is the lid. Okay, this is the lid. So for the lid, I just kind of copied this one and made it a little bit larger, as you can see, it's a bit a bit thicker and then you can grab another one it's like this shape and just put that in the center for the spout this is called the spout yeah so the lid and the spout and that's how you make a water bottle and i forgot to color this bottom piece so that is your water bottle shape okay that is your water bottle shape now it does look a little funny down here but that's the only way we can do it you know to make it hollow 
Maybe I'll make the spout a little bit smaller. Oh yeah, there we go. For the inside, this will be the fun part. Yeah, I kind of want to have like a different flooring for the water bottle. So I'm going to grab another. Okay, this is where I completely improvise everything else. This is all I've practiced. Now I improvise. I'm going to grab another vertical cylinder to make like a flooring for this place. Grab like another vertical cylinder here. Did I center it? I don't know. There we go. Oh gosh, that's not centered there. So this will be the flooring. I'm going to make that out of like planks or something wooden planks i don't know just so i could have like an actual sort of flooring for my build i'm gonna see if i can fill up the space a bit is that better i don't know okay that could be good okay there you go we got some sort of flooring now and then for the walls on the inside because these are basic shapes so whatever you color them it's gonna apply it to on both sides so i want to have like separate walls and stuff so maybe i'll just copy another one of these walls and then just kind of have like two walls i guess but basically we're just doing this twice like building the walls of the water bottle just doing it twice because i don't want it to be all blue on the interior you could have it all blue I was gonna actually just stick with that, but I wanna see if I can, I wanted to do like more with the inside of it. Okay, sweet. And then for this piece, of course, just do this, but color it. See, portable, portable, portable water bottle, portable water bottle. A little crazy there. There you go, cool. Now I have something and we can color this as well. No, we can't. <laughs> no, we can't, never mind. I lied. Since I want the ceiling, uh, I guess I'll keep the, I kind of want the ceiling inside of here to be different as well. So let's, once again, to another basic shape, like one more. This is good practice for me, honestly, like to just be familiar with basic shapes and stuff. And you can just like transform it here, like this. Not make any adjustments. And then you can like color that. I'm gonna make it like white or something. Let's just do a plastic white interior. So the interior is like not just all blue based off of this. You can of course adjust it. I wanna put a carpet in here. Okay, this is the fun part, guys. This is the fun part. We need to set up our, like, actual dispenser. We need to set up our station now inside of this water bottle, okay? So, let's go ahead and put our mini fridge in here. This is where we will store all of our water bottles. You could have a full-on size fridge. You really only just need, like, a fridge if you want to, like, store things. Um, and just dispenser, you know, just a dispenser. So I'm just gonna have maybe a console table. We'll just have like a little console table in here. But I feel like on all these walls here, I'm gonna have shelves full of the, um, the metal water bottles. <laughs> kind of like a display, but also just like a, kind of like a stock, you know, a stock full of water bottles. So I'm gonna use these shelves here and just place them, you know, just everywhere. Just everywhere. Because why not? Honestly, it's kind of spacious in here too. Now that I'm looking at it, like it feels pretty spacious for some reason. <laughs> for some reason. Okay, this was the plan though. It's just shelving everywhere. Now the spacing on this may not be the greatest, I feel, but it's so great. There's that. Now we need a little light in here because it is quite dark. Um, I'm thinking string lights. <laughs> I'm thinking string lights because any default lighting may not be the best because uh, if you try to put like a regular actually eh, there's lighting but you can't see it so i don't know if that's a good or bad thing maybe it's a good thing now i actually need a cash register if i'm going to be selling these i need a little cash register so maybe i can pop out like a little table here maybe a basic shape you know if it pops off the water bottle a little bit that's okay <laughs> that's fine we need that sign there we need that sign there um what else would i need maybe a trash can or something i'll have a little trash can i'll just get a fancy stool <laughs> this this build is already funny so let's just get a fancy stool we can sit down just fine but if we need to take care of our hygiene like energy is taken care of maybe some hygiene stuff maybe we could have a shower in here if we need to take a shower yeah i'm gonna put it right here right next to this blend it in so you can't really notice it but that's my shower oh this is so bright <laughs> it is so bright if i do another one oh my gosh it's gonna be so oh it's not that bad it's not that bad that's not that bright i don't know move some magazines maybe i'll have like a duffel bag inside here too for fun um i'll have crystals so i have a so i have a good chance of having like a nice successful business here some magical crystals you have a meditation cushion inside here too just so i can meditate if no one's at my shop um protein powder like protein shakes i'm gonna sell protein shakes i'm gonna ups upscale the prices um and then if i'm ever bored and i want to work out inside i'll just leave my dumbbells in here there you go a few plants so just to make this i make this place a little bit more interesting more lifelike we do need some greens in here we we'll just have like a very simple plant like that this could be the carpet, and I just do yoga on it. Okay, that's fine. I think that's it. Oh, we need to fill up our fun. Maybe I'll have, like, a TV in here or something, too. Just a small TV. <laughs> what if I just put it here? 
<laughs> I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna just put a little TV in there. They're, they're gonna be like, what is that? Okay, and there you have it. Our water bottle shaped water bottle stand. Oh, the furniture's not staying in there. Okay, that's fine. Maybe I'll grab some like or, like trees, some cherry blossom trees to put around this just to help it out a bit. Okay, I'm very tempted to put like a picnic table around here, even though it's just water and like protein shakes. I'll just, I'll put like a picnic table here. I'll put in two areas. If you want to chill here, sure, why not? Why not? Just have a place to sit. Maybe I'll get you guys a little picnic too. I'll get a little picnic table set up for whoever wants to chill here. We're here for the vibes, okay? We're here for the vibes. All right, there you go. <laughs> here it is. Our, oh, I gotta make a little sign now, actually. I'm gonna make a sign real quick. One moment. Okay, here's the sign that I made. That's it. I think I'm done. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me add my face to it. I'm gonna, just for advertising purposes. I should have gotten an updated photo of my face because I'm not wearing this, like, exact accessories anymore. I should call it stay hydrated. Remember when my thing was about, like, staying hydrated? Stay hydrated, water bottle, water bottle stand. Ew, that looks, that looks a little funny. Hold on, I think I need to, I don't know. The spacing is a bothering me. Let's, that, that's it, that's our sign. Let me go ahead and put this up. There you go. Ew. Okay. Okay. We gotta work on that a little bit. Hold on. <laughs> we, we gotta work on that a little bit. We gotta work on the placement a little bit. The water bottle shaped water bottle stand. So you got some outdoor seating here. If you want to just chill, you know, you grab your water bottle or your protein shake and just like, you know, sit down if you like. Have a snack. Some healthy fruits, fruits and such. And then, um, yeah, just very minimal um, landscaping, just trees, you know? We don't want to do too much here. We don't want to overwork ourselves. Then you jump on into the actual air, the actual shop and it's pretty like cozy in here. Like there's some, there's definitely space to move around and such. Like, look at me, wow. And then of course I got my dispenser so I can just make as many water bottles as possible. Like there's no animation for this. So you can just spam it and get them instantly, which is nice. I mean, at least we have the water bottles. Oh wait, we can't place the water bottles there ourselves on this shelf. Maybe we can sell like different colored water bottles too. Okay, I'll just put them on the floor. Okay, so there's that. And then, of course, I have the metal water bottles inside my fridge. So I'm going to get a few of these out and put them up on my shelves somehow. In fact, yes, you can change the color of these water bottles. So if someone doesn't like green, then there you go. They can have a yellow one. They can have a yellow one. They could have a blue one. They could have a red one if they want. You know, it'd be really cool if these could be refilled, you know, like refillable water bottles. So let's say like once you finish it, it's empty like those glass cups, those empty glass cups that you get, but you're also able to just refill it whenever you want. So it's actually like reusable, you know? Oh, there you go. I have it all set up now on the shelves, finally. Properly displayed now. So that's kind of like an idea of what I was thinking of. And yeah, you can, if you want, you can just do yoga inside when there's no customers and business is really slow. Do some yoga. You can watch some TV down here. <laughs> Don't watch some TV down there. You can meditate. Look at me, I'm floating! <gasps> I'm floating. That's kind of, that's crazy. Okay, and then we have protein powder, which I also cannot put on the shelf, but that's okay. And there you go. You sit down, watch your customers. Hi, what water bottle you want? But yeah, guys, that will wrap up this uh, this episode, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was fun to make. It was actually really fun to make another Strange Builds episode. If you guys did enjoy this, please give it a big old thumbs up, and make sure you hit that subscribe button because it's completely free, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. I didn't expect this to turn out like this. I actually am very fond of it. Maybe I should have turned it into a house. I don't know, but this is a fun idea.